Hello, everyone. My name is Yuko Tomizuka. I'm a global real estate investment advisor with 30 years of experience, and I have evaluated so far more than 20,000 uh, property cases. Today, I'd like to speak something about the local economy so that people, non-Japanese investors, uh, may have some hint to facilitate their business growth in Japan. Kyoto, the most efficient two parties democracy, realized. Recently, when I was discussing with the presence of small to middle-sized businesses in the greater Kyoto, I found out that Kyoto is probably a quite unique city where two parties democracy has been realized in the local community. According to Kyoto governor's transition uh, described in Wikipedia, 1950 to 1978, the Communist Party was a ruling party in Kyoto. Since 1978, the Liberal Democratic Party, LDP, has been the ruling party. However, the Communist Party has always been the second and won the high voting ratio. For instance, the recent election in 2018, the Communist Party accounted for 44 percent of total voters. Through the discussion and the insight from the, those local business leaders, I have come up with the following reasons why such two parties democracy has been working in Kyoto. Number one, war history. Number two, local isolation. Number three, criticism spirit. Number four, also rebellious spirit. Let me explain one by one. Uh, number one is war history. Since Kyoto was settled as a center of politics in the 8th century in Japan, over 1,200 1, years of history, the local people have experienced various wars. Some are among samurai warriors, some are associated with political power dominance, and others were based on religious schools and positions. Through those experiences, people have got well understood that keeping one political party dominance may sooner or later face a crisis, which means a dictator, a danger of a dictatorship. And therefore, if the current ruling party gets a second party, they would play a law over a whistleblower and the other way around when the opposition party takes the first seat. By doing this, a sort of balance should be maintained and people, people's wish and will must be reflected in their politics. This can be interpreted as Kyoto people's mindset. Number two, local isolation. I don't have any impression that either Kyoto Communist Party is very close to other socialism countries or Kyoto LDP has got well along with so-called Western society. So this is a sort of isolation. This is simply because the Kyoto golden rule to get involved in Kyoto society, one has to be welcomed by the local community as comrade, regardless of political position, belief, or any creators. Unless one can demonstrate his or her fittest to Kyoto community, he or she would never get involved in any local activities. This is tricky part, but also has allowed Kyoto political parties to be independent in a position, uh, in a positive sense from external influences. Number three, criticism. This is somehow related with the point number one. Kyoto people basically have strong criticism attitude towards a system imposed by the government. This has been seen in a positive way in technologies in Kyoto. Kyocera, Omuro, Murata, and also Nintendo Kyoto-based big name companies have developed themselves with criticism and a challenging spirit. They have pushed themselves hard to make a breakthrough against so-called market standard or common senses. Number four, rebellious spirit. Since the Meiji Revolution in 19th century, the political center of Japan has been in Tokyo, and this directly or indirectly raised a sort of rebellious spirit among Kyoto people. Just before the election of Kyoto governor, a North lady in Kyoto had a media interview. She mentioned that she was going to vote the Communist Party as she has supported the conservatives. In her mind, good old days were brought about the governor of communist, and therefore the, com the conservative party in her mind is the Communist Party. To sum up, taking into account the our culture, background, history, and local people's mindset, so-called ideal two parties Democrat has been realized in Kyoto. I personally feel that this may be the model in the world in the sense that the actual democracy has been the realized or driven by local people. If you like this video, please click like button and my channel also. Thank you.
and thank you for your attention.